guys good morning happy wednesday to you all i hope when you come across this video it finds you well welcome to the channel sonia's adventure guys i want to just jump right into it because i don't want this video to be too long this issue guys with strongman 254 i don't want to laugh because it is such a serious issue <laughs> but I want to tell you, if you don't have the time and the patience to go around and watch these different videos that people are putting out, you will not get the true picture of what is happening with some of these people in your and say some of these people who are in Mara's compound, some of these people who are working for Mara. This issue, guys, with Strongman 254. When we saying that the man looks sad, the man look like he's having issue with the work. He's not getting paid. He's frustrated. He probably want to go home to his family. Always in his room, not associating with anybody. Seem overworked and tired. Can't get an opportunity to hear really how he feels because Mara put him on camera. Put him out into the public and it seems as if it, that frightens him. So he never gets to say what he really wants to say. And maybe behind the background, he's still not talking to Mara. They are not probably not talking to each other. Well, they must be talking to each other. But, you know, when Mara put him on camera and saying that he has been looking so sad for the past three days i'm saying you could have asked him that off camera so when you put him on camera maybe he realizes why mara is putting him on camera and then he just shut down but he's been talking to other people and if you watch some of his video i keep using the word overwhelming challenging let me tell you something. He did a he did an interview with Irene Jep. Irene Jep did an interview with him. And you see when he mentioned in Mara's video the other day about <laughs> the plumber, the engineer, <laughs> and Mara shut him down. Irene Jep came back and asked him about the engineer. <laughs> And the strong man 254 is not a man who will laugh very often. He's always looking serious. He laughed. When she asked him about the engineer, he laughed. First thing he did, he laughed. <laughs> hey, help me. He laughed. And he said, as far as I am concerned, I am sorry to say this. But we don't have an engineer here. We have a foreman. Because an engineer don't stay on site. Engineer of the office elsewhere. They come and they, they look at the work. Inspect the work. Pass it. Or whatever. Or if something is wrong. They point it out. Whatever. That's what engineer does. They don't stay on site. And when he went to talk about he further move on to talk about hey, the size of the columns and those outside pipes running along the building that everybody can't see the outside of the building and the same pipes that Mara was complete has been complaining about that they look unsightly right a modern building should not have pipes exposed on the outside and that was even the reason that brought him to mara's place because he said when he saw the pipes that he specifically said the green pipe he knew that something was off right and he came and this <laughs> he came and so this is the position that he has found himself in the other part plumber took flight and now he's left holding the bag not even getting paid for it he didn't say that i am saying it 
and I am saying it because it is out here in the public. Okay, so you Mara supporters don't come for me because I am a Mara supporter too. But I say things as I see it. And I'm not going anywhere to dig up any information. It's what people is putting out here that I am talking about including Mara too. He said the, the pipes should either be inside the columns. Some of them should be inside of the columns. But some of the columns are too big for the pipes. And he elaborated, I can't say everything that he said here because he's talking in his plumber terms. Okay, but you can go and watch Irene's video. I'm going to put the title up here. And I'm carrying clips of nobody's um, video here as evidence. Some people say, I don't bring evidence, I don't bring receipt. But Codesta brought evidence and receipt using other people's um videos and that is why she's doing charity work now on on youtube okay three months before they might even consider her um to monetize our videos so what she's doing now she's just doing it for the sake of doing it she's not getting paid okay so that is what evidence bring you when you want to use people's video at it talking about you bringing receipts i'm not bringing no, no receipt take my word for it i'm not lying up here or i can send you to go and watch people's videos not a problem to me to make mention of people's video because i'm not bad-minded i want all of us to make money up here so you can see clearly in that video and guys go and watch the video because he gave it to that engineer sloppy work sloppy work and we don't know why mara is protecting this engineer we understand that this engineer came on board when nobody else believed in 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 what mara were, um wanted to do by building this house building this house they didn't believe because the size of the house and everything Right, and they didn't know his source of income and whatever the engineer said it. So, three engineers he said came and didn't certify the grounds as being suitable to put up a building. But it seemed as if Mara got that opportunity with him. So they go back a long way, and he's been here with mara up until today so mara has some love for the man even though mara guys mara told us the other day you see when the negative reactors came out and said um started calling him fake engineer fake engineer because he was digging holes all over the premises proposing to put up outdoor latrines and whatever in that same time, Mara came and told us that he had heated words with that engineer. But they are still together. But the plumber, Strongman254, is saying this plumber, who is supposed to be a learned person, when you're putting up a building, you're supposed to know where to put the water pipes, electrical work. You have to do it step by step and he laid it out. This man is so knowledgeable. I have to support him and we have to support him. I watch his videos. I watch the ads. Okay. We have to support him because he's doing a tremendous job on that property. When I heard that man said, none of the pipes had tangent. Imagine water being pumped through those lines and those beautiful tiles that Mara treasure so much water seeping beneath them what would happen if this man hadn't arrived we have to support him watch his videos guys watch them in their entirety 
watch the ads like the videos share the videos so that he can make some money because that's the only way he's making money working there and he's doing so much work he has also acknowledged that some persons have been sending him money but he has a family he has two kids that are going to private school and he has said the fees for them plus he has to pay rent and, and a wife and himself to take care of that's a lot of money and he's not getting paid after doing so much work he still has to produce videos edit videos put them out sometimes we can see how tired this man is sometimes he's even working without an assistant mm? i remember he had one assistant and and mara what is this mara sent to him that guy said he should go home and go to school he love money too much and there's another guy that he had working with him the other day i think his name is macquarie 17 and that guy left he said he has a child to take care of he has a family to take care of he has himself to take care of even to upload a video he said how much it costs he has to buy what they call name bundles or something something so that he can upload this video so everything costs money so if somebody is not putting money in your pocket how are you going to stay there and continue to work so he left and people saying he's saying bad about mawa saying bad about the condition i don't think he's i don't see where i've not seen that video because if the man is expressing that he needs money to survive that is not saying bad about mawa he's just speaking the truth guys also one thing I'm going to say this very quickly. One thing that I've picked up in this video too with Strongman254. He wants to go home and spend time with his family. But he's very, very concerned about um this the drainage system. He's talking about the drainage system and the and the um and the the septic tank the tank that the waste water goes in or the waste goes in how small it is and i'm saying this engineer was there and this engineer didn't even know that that septic tank was too small he was there because we saw him there and it takes a different plumber to come now and tell them that that pit is too small they also have six six kitchens he said and maybe twice that amount of bathrooms or how many 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 bathrooms and for that that thing that they build there eh? it is too small and the man even gave them the size the standard measurement that the septic pit is supposed to be and the engineer allowed that man to build that septic it. and no it is causing so much problem because even mara mara was the one who pointed it out to us and say he's having a hell of a problem with it people can't use some of the bathrooms tissue clogging up clogging up the pipes eh it's overflowing and so this man want to go home and spend time with his family but he can't and i'm thinking that maybe that is one of the reasons why he has been looking so sad because he's looking at the volume of work that he still has to do and he's saying if he leaves and go home who is going to assist and who 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 are they going to call when this condition arises he says he can go home and come back and do some things but while the party is going on so many people are there there are no portable toilets or anything like that they seem as if everybody's using the inside bathrooms eh? and the chaos that is taking place do you know i saw them like they dig in a trench along the front side of the house go around to the other side and then 
they have if they they say that they can't they can't extend the pit they have to build a new pit can you imagine the volume of work and this work has to get done while people are there while the party is still going on and then he has to think about coming back and correcting more issues inside the house. Mm? Can you can have sewage flowing out on the grounds or whatever issue that they have in it is so important. Whatever it is, it is so important that the man can leave the premises to go home. He must have to stay there and correct that problem and that's a whole lot of work. Guys, please support Strongman254. Watch his videos. Watch them from start to finish. If you're cooking, if you're cleaning, whatever you're doing, play his videos and play them out. Watch the ads. Like them, share them. Let's support him. Okay? Because he's doing a hell of a job there to make everybody comfortable. That villa cannot be. The villa that Mara wants it to be. Unless they have running water in that place. People can access uh, um, the bathrooms. Clean the place. Have water to use in the kitchen. Huh? Have water for people outside to cook and clean and do everything else that they're doing. I wonder if people realize. The tremendous job that this man is doing. If you don't have water, that place would have to be shut down. Mm? Let's support him, guys. I leave it right here. And I'll come back another time with another video. Because I'm watching things going on there. And I have much, much more that I want to say next time, guys. Thanks for watching.